Okay, you guys are not gonna believe this. Um, another attack in broad daylight. Please subscribe right now if you wanna see it all unfold. Come here, smell it. Go find it. Come here, Gracie. Gracie, smell it. See it? Oh, Sean! Oh, crap. Okay, so we got an interesting video for you guys today. Um, this morning, um, before church, we're actually, me and Hallie were leaving for church and a uh, big wild hog was hitting the fence again, trying to attack our Cooney Cooney pigs. Um, these things are vicious, they're crazy, but the, the difference between this video and the last time we encountered one and shot one, I actually caught it on camera. Um, it all unfolded so quick, but I was able to go get my camera, get the 243 and take the shot. I'm gonna show you guys all of that. And then um, when you, after that, we're gonna go try to recover um, the wild boar. This thing is, is crazy. You wait till you see it. Um, it actually gave me like a really good shot and stuff, but Brandy and the girl seen everything unfold. And uh, we'll talk about that in just a second. I saw it went like this. And I think poor little Pearl and Percy were just sleeping. They're they never oblivious. even came out. They never they came out. They came out when, they, when you shot. Yeah. And Eddie took off. He was terrified. and just trying to get into the pig pen. other one I don't know if I got on camera taking the shot this time I pulled out the rifle and I was shooting through the two fences but it looked like to me it was about to take off oh I nailed it there's blood Pearl, Percy, you guys okay? Look, it was just sitting over here trying to wait to get in. Pooping. Pearl, Percy, keeps coming back. Keeps coming back. This time I upped my game. If you guys remember last time when it charged at me, it, uh, I shot with my nine millimeter, my nine millimeter, because that's all I had on me. Well, that's all I had on me again was my nine, but this time I stopped, got the camera out, got my rifle, um, I took the shot and this bleeding everywhere. I think I don't think it's gonna make it through this one. This is awesome. Awesome, awesome. These things are tough too though. I use a lot better round. I actually got my kit, my hunting, my uh, girls hunting 243 rifle. Uh, my 270s put up in my, all of my other rifles. We're at my nephew's house in the safe because we when we transitioned. But I need to go get my other stuff too. This is crazy. This is so nuts because you never expect this and it always happens when it, you don't expect it. There's blood everywhere, absolutely everywhere. So I'm just gonna peek around over here just to see if I see it. Um, if I don't, I'm just gonna back out and when I get out of church, I'll come look for it again. So this time I, will, <laughs> I got Brandy and them up and said the big pig's back. This is a different one though. This one looks like about half the size of the other one. Blood everywhere, everywhere. He's taking the same path, the exact same path as he did last time. Just follow him right through here. 
He's back and he's meaner than ever. <laughs> I want to recover this one. Okay. Where'd he go? I, I hope he just stays on my property. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay. So, I'm gonna back out. I know right where his blood trail's at. To me, as of right here, he's still on my property. Looks like he's going deeper into my property. So we're just gonna wait. <clears throat> we're gonna go to church. When we come back, we're gonna pick this back up. Um, I'll get my dogs out here and um, we'll start seeing if we can if we can find them. This is crazy. Never expected it again. I told Hadley, I said, Hadley, the hog is back. Stay in here. And what's crazy is my German shepherds, you know, they're guard dogs and they do a really good job. But when these things are sneaking around like they do, I mean, they don't know. We got the generator running. We got the other animals making noise. Um, so they're actually over there by their pen because when we leave, we put them up for a little bit and then when we come back, we let them out. Well, that's what they were doing. They're ready to go in. So when I got out, when I got out, they were in their pen. So that would make it easy on me because I didn't want this thing to get chased off. Uh, but yeah. So when we come back, we'll pick this back up in a couple hours and um, we'll see if we can come find this, find this boar. There's blood everywhere, just like last time. But the difference is, so I stepped it up this time, pulled the 243 out, and took the shot through two fences, and still was able to nail it. No, it's blood everywhere, but I'm gonna wait till we get back from church to look for it some more. It's got, it's still on our property. I'll get the dogs out, and we'll look for it when we get home. Yeah, that's pretty bad. Oh, I shot it right in the side. It was broadside to me. No, I don't know if it's, it's all the way down. I'm gonna let, so I don't push it. You just keep pushing, it'll keep running. So just gonna let it die. Yeah, this is crazy. Brandy and them came out. I woke all them up, I said it's back. So they're all wanting to come out. Like I said, no, just wait. And they, and they could see it through the window. That's how obvious it was, but it was right here. You guys seen it on video, I finally caught it. It was like right in here somewhere, where the poop's at. So, from what I could tell, this one's about half the size of the first one. Um, it's still a good sized boar, but not near as big as the first one that came up. Um, at least that's what my memory's telling me anyways. It's still a good sized one. We'll be, we'll be back after church and we'll go look for it. <laughs> crazy. What? I got bottled water if you want to drink. You ain't got to bring a, a bowl to drink out of Brandy. Oh, All right, while you're feeding them, I'm going to tell everyone what's going on. Okay, so you guys seen everything that happened. Um, that was first thing this morning. And uh, now we're going to go try to recover it. Brandy's feeding the mini horses, some of their little pacey stuff they eat. Um, it was crazy how that all went down. It was pretty much the same exact scenario as the very first time um, a couple, like, two or three weeks ago that I showed you guys. But the difference is I actually caught this one on camera. <coughs> Did you first think it was the same one? No, because it looks smaller. It, it looks smaller. Uh, she asked me if I thought the same one. I said, no, I think this one was quite a bit smaller. And it was big. And it was this one was big too. Um, but hopefully we can recover if you guys seen I probably slow mowed it it actually hit the fence the bullet and I was afraid of that um, but to me it was worth the risk being a wild boar that's gonna attack and kill the animals out here on the homestead uh, so I was willing to take that chance and we're gonna we're gonna go over there and we're gonna see if I can find where I actually hit the fence because in the video it looks like it hit it and I hit the hog high I think the shot was on until it hit that and went up but it, it has to it was blood everywhere from so, so, view, so you seen everything. I came woke you up. Yeah, from my view up at the house, I thought it went like more. It's like back yeah. area. But you think it was lower than that? No, it, it went it went up. I'll show you. Hit the fence. It went up. I hit it high, um, but there's blood everywhere. I think we're gonna find it. I don't know though. We'll see. I didn't see. You think this is a lot more blood than the first yeah, one? Yeah, yeah. And we got the German Shepherds with us, Gavin Grace. We're gonna bring them. So what happened? I came in there and I woke you up. Well. Him and Hadley sometimes go to church early for this other 
like youth thing that they'll do in the mornings. And so I thought, oh, I'm gonna sleep for like 30 more minutes. <laughs> and as soon as I closed my eyes, you said the hog's back. So we all jumped up. And... You guys watched everything from the window. Yeah. You could actually and, seen it, Hope? Yeah, I saw it went poo. And then um, they were standing over there and Eddie jumped and Eddie ran jump. away. Well, and I was afraid he was gonna like take off but he just slowly went behind their shelter and see, then I didn't went see behind all that. the tree. He was kind of just slowly. And you yep. said you thought he was like going to the bathroom over there. Yeah, he was pooping over there. Um, and in the video, you haven't seen it yet. He turns perfectly broadside to me, but I was shooting over a gate and through a fence. Uh, yeah. Um, not a, yeah, so either we're gonna find it or we're not. Either way, is, I don't think is it, that one's gonna be coming back either. So we'll see. But that shows there's a lot of them yeah. out. So we're gonna drive around to where I felt I stopped looking for it earlier and we're gonna pick up the trail there. I've got my 45, my nine millimeter, my 243. That's what we shot I shot at this morning. You've got hope. I got hope, I got the dogs, I got Brandy. So I think we're gonna find it. Bobby. I hope Bobby doesn't follow us. He will. The chickens will follow the will. So I don't know if it's worth setting a trap up. Um, at the very least, I think we need to put some cameras up out here yeah, along the perimeter. They of the fence. always go to that side. Yeah. Like two times they went to that one side. It, was, it, it played out exactly the same as the first one. It was crazy. Uh, he charged the fence, hit the fence. And that same time of morning. Yeah, same time, like 7:30 in the morning. So he was right there. Yeah, I'm gonna park right over here and we're gonna walk over there, Brandy, and we're gonna just look hey, at the fence. My, there's one of my lids. Yeah. So Something we're. Uh, uh, probably the pig pen. All right, so let's walk over here. We're gonna he look at. Smell blood right there. She probably does. That's why we brought it. I think the dogs are gonna help us track it for sure. But let's walk over oh, here. We're we'll walk over here and see if we can see where um, I hit the fence. It was on this other side of this tree, I think. Right look for a broken stop. wire, Brandy, over here. It was by the stop foot. On camera, it looked like I, I hit the fence and shot high. I think it was right here somewhere. I think you actually hit it because it ran away. Yeah, it's right here. They're right here. But on camera, there's a poop. They're on it. They already smell it. That's disgusting. It is pooping. You called it. The blood goes right here. I was on that side, so I think I shot it right here somewhere. Which tree was it? I thought I, I could see where the fence broke on camera, but I could be wrong. It came. Okay, from our from our angle, it was behind one of the trees. I think it was behind this tree. So I think this is where it was at, Brad. I can see its footprints. It ran that way where Hope's at. Yeah, I got the blood trail over there. Or but I mean, would it immediately bleed? You found some blood? There's a bunch over there. I'm just trying to see the fence, if I actually did hit the fence, because it looked like I did on camera. You see any wires broke? Ricochet? Yeah, but it looked like the wire actually broke on camera. But it's hard to tell. It's a long ways away. I was thinking it was like right here somewhere, because I see its footprint. I mean, when I took the shot, though, I think it was right here. Huh. What? There it is. I thought it was more like over here. Man, it looks like he's been over here before. Look how it's all trampled down. Something's over here. When you saw it, it was Right in there, wasn't it? That's what I thought too. I saw you do it. On camera, it looked like I hit the wire, but I guess not. But this is like all beat up. All these prints, I think, Brandon, I think they're coming here at night and when we're not here. What do you think, Hope? Look at all this. Thankfully, our fence, tracks. Yeah. fence is pretty Those are steady. deer tracks. And those no, those are, are all hog dogs. traps. They uh, are. Yeah, that could That's be several hogs. One. This is crazy. I never even walked over here. So there's a bunch of them. Look, here's some. Yeah. So this is telling us that these hogs have been coming whenever we're not seeing them. So we need to put some cameras up out here so we can catch them. All right, well, I don't see the fence where I hit it. Maybe I didn't hit it, just kind of looked like it on camera. Let's go pick up the blood trail. All right, let's go pick the blood trail up. It's over here. Oh, so you can't get it. Where's the initial? Right over there, where that poop's at over there. Is there a lot? Well, there is a lot over here. 
How far did you go? Right over here. Uh. Oh, I see blood. Yeah, it's bleeding. Oh, get it. We're gonna get that one, right? Uh, I mean, it's bigger dots than what you and I saw last oh, time. Oh, I see some. Yeah, there's a bunch on this tree over here. So it probably is rubbing against the. Do I need to spray some of this on? I did yeah. on our legs, on we? Get ready for this, guys. I'll show them. Look for some blood. Look at all that. I found a lot. Yeah, right here. All that blood. Okay, look at all this blood right here. And all right here. Yeah, There's a lot right behind the ranger. All on that tree. So this is where I stopped this morning, right here. So now we're gonna try to track it. Come here, Gabby. Gabby. There Come here, Grace. Come here, Gabby. Right Gabby. Here. Come here. Smell it. Go find it. Come here, Gracie. Gracie, smell it. See it. All right, come on. Now, now this is where I don't know where it went from here. So. Oh my! So we gotta keep going. They finally got a, a, a better shot on one of them because there's a lot of blood. Get a gap. There's blood covered on this rock. Hey, if you see blood, don't be kicking it. Just you need to show us. Are they on some right there too? Oh, Sean! Oh crap! I'm like right <laughs> there. What? That's that just scary. scared you. Well, we got a dead hog, guys. Oh my gosh, that's Good find, me. Brandy. Hey, dog, hello. Wow, look at this, guys. I was literally right here this morning. I didn't even see it right there. Oh, I'm so glad we found it. Man, that's a big one. No, it ain't live. It's been there for about four hours. That is crazy. So, I was gonna try to eat it, the back straps, but it's been here for about four hours. We'll see. Look at this, guys. Man, that is a big boar. There's a lot of blood. Yeah, it ran right over here. I never even see it. It's camouflaged perfectly in there. No, I just, well, I was thinking all that blood, there has to be. Yeah. Say, hey, that's crazy. Does it feel stiff? We call it ticks on it. Yeah, we ain't eating this. Oh my gosh. Well, there's definitely, oh, that's, that's a ton of ticks. Hey, Move, girls, move. Gabby, go see. Look at that, Brandy. Oh my gosh. What's in its nose? They're just freaking me. What's in its nose? Don't touch it. <laughs> Don't touch it. It's a booger. <laughs> Look at that. Wow. Here, here. Look how mean that thing looks. So you think the other one was way bigger? Yeah, the other one was bigger than this. So the other one's tusk. You can see the tusk right there. It was, they were like way out. Is that one, has it broke off? No, we'll flip it over and look too. There's so a spider you, on it. Yeah, flip it over because the side that was down. Man, look how mean they are though. See, I honestly, I mean that, I guess that does look like a lot. Yeah. But I thought this trail would have even more blood. Yeah, the grass didn't even help at all. <laughs> Mom found it before Mom's we can go too far. That is now, a lot of blood right there. If, we would, if I would have found this morning, I probably would have got the back straps off of it and we could have at least ate it. It actually, but that's not. I mean, these are different than like animals you're gonna raise on the homestead for me. These are trying to kill your livestock. Yeah, but they're still edible. Yeah, okay, look at that. I'm gonna flip it over. Let's put this in the thunder and roll it over. It got a lung. They don't have any ears. I thought that was weird. Wow, there's no ears on it. Why? Did they get eat off? I don't off? know. That's crazy. No ears, Hope. What do you think? That's big. Is that crazy? That's what I smell. Do you think they got bit off? Yeah, from fighting and stuff. Wow. I don't even see like an ear connect. I see, I do. Barely. So I got a lung. So I definitely, I got a lung. It's bubbling out. Quit. Um, this is, I mean, I bet this is every bit of 250 easily. But like how do you describe the other one? This one's little. Compared. Oh no! I think the other one's like double. So when I seen this one, yeah, when I seen this one, I knew it wasn't the same one, just on the size, and I couldn't see the tusk rolling out. Oh. Uh, I bet this one's every bit of 250-ish, around give or take, probably. No, they don't. I can't want. believe it's no ears. I know that's what crazy. So look how nasty these things are. The deer's got lots of ticks too, but look at that. All those ticks. Oh. Crazy, huh? 
so there's no I'm not even gonna attempt to harvest this one but we need to we need to move it somewhere so, so I'm gonna the coyotes and, and the cut, yeah yeah I don't know if I can get my I get the ranger in right here and can then just wrap around its feet I don't want to put it yeah we can or I could pull up and back we could the, throw in the pond huh we could throw no, in that'll the pond. ruin the pond look at his teeth guys you see him Brandy yeah yeah this one's a baby compared to the other one that's that's a good size one too 250. Look. yeah okay i'm gonna load it up in the back of the ranger and then we're gonna go take it to a different side of the property away from our animals so the coyotes and stuff and birds they can go over there and eat it um oh, yeah we'll do that perfect. i'll move the ranger over here brandy and then i'll back up to it and i'll load it up here they're usually nocturnal well, so they're awake at, at night, night. Still kind of when we wake up in the morning for church, they're still around. Yeah. Because it's kind of dark. Hayden, so how, how, show her where the blood was right there. And then it went right here. And his blood is bubbling on its back. Can you help? Yeah. Those are ticks. Yeah. Yeah. Move, move. Disgusting. Move, Gabby. We're Gracie. Those are ticks. Have blood purple. Boy, it stinks so bad. Okay, we got her loaded up. I'm still debating, Brandy. Does it have an ear on this side at all, like a hole? No. I think it has like a birth sometimes. I don't know. I was debating on six cutting the back strap off. Yeah. Okay. It's right inside there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull it off, and I'm gonna I'm gonna keep that strap to it. So no coyotes can pull it off and then come back and get the skull once all the birds and stuff eating it. Oh, tie it to the Yeah, because if we don't, they'll drag it all over the place and maybe we'll all still be able to get it. All the vultures will come. Yep. We saw a lot of vultures this morning yep. eating dead fish. So we'll come back out the season and we'll put a camera up out here too and see all the coyotes because we hear coyotes every night. So that's one hog down. We, there's one, I guess there's more. Um, I would still wish we would have found the big one. I'm just glad we found this little one though. And yeah, it just tells you how nasty these pigs are. And they just look mean. Look how mean it looks, Randy. It's a long tail. Yeah, it's crazy. Like on the line So I said two, the more I look at it, the. You don't think it's as I think high? it's 250. I think it's between 225 and 250 well, is what I think. It up. Yeah, it's pretty good, pretty good size. Like I said, it's been like, like five hours. It hasn't been about five hours since we've um, Like 7.30 and it's, yeah. It's like 70, degree, 70 degrees right now too. It's still a little limp. Well, I'm not gonna they jack said it was 80 outside. Oh, really? Yeah. It's still bubbling. Well, because it was laying down and now he's put it over. <laughs> okay, so I don't think they're gonna, it's gonna go anywhere. We're gonna get a camera and set up on here and we'll see what eats it. Brandy, what do you think? What's your thoughts on wild hog trying to kill Percy and Pearl? Don't like it. And they're oblivious. They just sleep through it all. It's crazy. <laughs> this one is deformed. They're, that's how the other one looked. Look just like no, this one, ears, but smaller. Yeah, the ears. I don't know. That's nasty. Do they have ears? Yeah. Like most of the time they do. Pigs? Yeah. Yeah, it's that's a crazy. There's like dirt in it. It's yeah, a they're nasty. Hog. Yeah. So this one, it's seen me several times. It's seen the truck. It looked at me. When we first, when I first saw it, it did exactly what the other one did. It was charging, hit the fence, and I said, oh, Holly, there it is. And um, I tried to get my phone out to film it. I guess I didn't hit record because I have no phone service or phone uh, footage. footage. So then I told Brandy, what did I tell you last time? If another one comes, what did I tell you? Like if you another were one comes your up. Camera, yeah. For sure. I, don't what that's if I told you, yeah, I told you I probably had enough time. Yeah. Well, what if it came out when you're at church? We went to that we one. still there. I think they are, they have been because of all the footprints. So I told Brandy last time, I said, next time if one comes up, time. I'm going to take my time, go get a rifle, go get the camera. That's what I did to show you guys. Um, yeah, and it all worked out that's really well. I saw you hit. I said back. Yeah. And it's pretty. 
I knew I hit it high. I could tell. I could tell I hit it high in the video, but in the video it looked like I hit the fence. But I guess I didn't because we didn't find any broken fence. So I mean, if like the best spot would it be like right? Yeah, right behind the shoulder. So but pretty for, much on. Yeah. So how? So how I hit it? It still hit a lung. That's why it only went by 80 yards and, and died. I still can't believe I didn't see it this morning because I was like five feet from it or probably 10 yards from it. Um, but yeah. So this is the danger of living on a homestead out in the middle of the woods when there's wild hogs, you just don't ever know what to expect. So Brandy, you're gonna start carrying a pistol with you when you go out and feed. Well, or not feed when it's You're gonna dark. start carrying a pistol when you yeah, come out and feed. Guys, tell of... Brandy she needs to protect herself. It'd be funny if she's just being <laughs> But we so we always, what's crazy, years. you know the dogs could be running them off and we just don't see them. Yeah. Cause they are always chasing stuff off in the woods. I, I always Bunnies. assume it's, yeah, rabbits or deer, um, but definitely could be. So this is, it's pretty interesting. I've never seen a wild hog with no ears, but it doesn't have any ears at all. It has one little canal on one side, the other one's all closed off. So it might be another way I was able to sneak up on it, even though it's seen me. What if it's death? Yeah, I think it is. Um, it's seen me, and that's when it looked at me. That's when I got out of the truck and I went to get the camera. The time I got the camera and the rifle and came back around bringing the girl seen it moving. I never seen it until I got out. It, was it walked its way around. Line. Yeah, it was going up and down the fence line. And you guys seen where we found the tracks of it going up and down the fence line. Um, so they're, they're it, it, or it or more of them. Yeah. So this is kind of, it's kind of alarming that we're going to have to be really, uh, what's that word? Uh, vigilant. vigilant when it comes to this, that's two in like two or three weeks. I can't remember the last mm -hmm. was like three weeks or two weeks ago. Um, but these things are attacking in broad daylight and they're showing no mercy for us. So we're going to show no mercy for them. So, all right. Yes, hope sir. you guys enjoyed this little bit of video. Um, and if you did, smash that like button. If you're not subscribed yet, please subscribe to the channel. We're doing all kinds of stuff like this all the time. I think you guys really enjoy it. All right. Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video.